Let's talk about the topic of egg freezing. The decision of when or if to do this is becoming really important to many women, especially as people are gaining more and more knowledge about the topic. So the important thing to me about this is that this is an extremely personal decision and also it's a medical decision. So every woman has to take into account their individual, individual goals and their family goals and personal life goals um, as far as whether or not to do this. So if you're in your 20s and you want a huge family, this is maybe something that you should lean towards. If you're 35 and you're still working on your stellar career, then this is something you should consider. And when you get older as well, there's other options that can be discussed. Many people ask, when will they need in vitro fertilization? It's important to know that at Texas Fertility Center, this is actually only about a quarter of the infertility treatments that we provide. In fact, most patients are able to get pregnant with much less invasive methods. However, sometimes we do need to refer people to in vitro fertilization. And some of the times that this could be the case would be if you have a more severe, severe male factor, you may have a tubal factor that's not reversible. Some couples have genetic conditions that need to be screened for and we can do this through IVF. Or it may be for advanced maternal age or couples who have already gone through failed intrauterine insemination cycles.